The weather forecast for the coming days may see significant developments, with Eastern Europe expected to experience a major frost wave, while the situation in the Mediterranean may be more complex and subject to various variables. Current prediction models indicate a notable regional push, which could hinder the movement of cold air masses toward the western parts of the continent. However, the margin of uncertainty will remain high, as the evolution of this dynamic will depend on the interaction between the atmospheric forces, which are still in the process of consolidation. The average forecast from the GS model is expected to continue indicating the presence of frost near the peninsula, suggesting that Italy could also be affected by this configuration. The key to the entire process lies in the complex relationship between the stratospheric polar vortex and the ongoing anomalies in the troposphere. Although there is a clear tendency for the vortex to reestablish itself, the current phenomenon is not limited to merely stabilizing the currents. On the contrary, the continued warming of the stratospheric layer would exacerbate the friction caused by the thermal opposition between the different air masses, a mechanism that could have direct repercussions on the atmospheric circulation across the Atlantic European region. One of the most interesting aspects involves the potential formation of an event that could be classified as a TST event, troposphere-stratosphere-troposphere coupling. This phenomenon occurs when thermal contrast in the troposphere can propagate to the stratosphere and then reflect downward, leading to a significant change in meteorological dynamics on a hemispheric scale. If this hypothesis is confirmed, we might witness a development between the end of February and the beginning of March, characterized by a new high-pressure push over the northern latitudes, particularly affecting the Scandinavian sector.